Hello again, this is Lisa Bowles, your Soul Mapper, and you are now watching the next episode of Soul Map TV. You may remember a couple of episodes ago, uh, I brought our joint attention to the tabletop troop, which you may notice are no longer here. And I brought to our collective attention that the process of starting something like new, just like this show, is one of experimentation, feedback. So is it working? How do you like it? Did it... So we decided to experiment. And between bringing up that original feedback, people loving, and how come they're there? Um, and this episode, we created an episode where the tabletop troupe we're not present. Now I'd like to tell you where they've gone and why we decided to tinker with that one. See if you can see yourself in this. So a couple of things, uh, pieces of feedback we got was that having them there without understanding why they were there was distracting. It was um, taking people's ability to, to just enjoy the video, to take in the benefit of the information that was being provided. It was kind of um, fracturing their attention. And that wasn't the kind of outcome we were hoping to create. So we looked at me having touchstones here, hoping to use touchstones to help make a point, and that interfering with the experience uh, that we were hoping to create for people. Now, some people who've watched the videos and have heard about why the Touchstone Gang was here would understand it and might not be quite so, what the, what, me. Uh, and be able to focus. But because there's a lot of new people coming this way, we had to really think about it. So we decided to experiment, which is why they're not here. Um, in fact, what we heard most was people loved Animal, but they found that their attention kept getting pulled to him. And so we had to decide whether or not using the touchstones to convey something, a business basic that's important, was at the same time interfering with something larger. And so we made the decision to experiment. I'd love to hear from you what your experience now is that the tabletop troop are gone. Is having a more spacious, visually undistracting uh, experience working for you? Would you like to see them back? Um, and tell us what having them there did for you. Did it act as a talisman? Did it give you a sense of the show, or me, or the feel of Soul Map TV? We'd really love to get your feedback about that. And while you're giving feedback, think about this for your business. As you're creating a home and extending an experience, remember from the last episode, experience foundational, right? As you're extending an experience, creating an experience, what building blocks do you want to be there and are they doing for the people that you're hoping to create the experience for? Are they doing for them what you think they will? Good check-in. If you found this review and experimentation check useful, please let me know. Um, let us know your thoughts and your feedbacks as we've already um, suggested because that helps us know what's going on to make sure that this is the best experience it can be for you. And if you've gone through this process, weeding things out, adding them in, you know, experimenting, and you've got some tricks up your sleeve, let us know, richness of the community and all that, okay? Um, we're publishing some new stuff. Every couple of weeks, there's something new going up on the website. So if you'd like to be in the know, stuff that just doesn't show up in the webisodes, make sure you subscribe, okay? Make sure you share this too. This could be a foundational piece for people, particularly if they're building a new website, creating a brand new newsletter or doing a video show like this one, okay? As you go back out there doing the brave work that being a pur purposeful entrepreneur requires, please keep these words close to your heart. You weren't an accident. You weren't mass produced. You aren't an assembly line product. You were deliberately planned, specially gifted, and lovingly positioned on earth by the master artisan. It's time we built our businesses that way. That's it for this episode of Soul Map TV. Until next time, this is Lisa Bowles, your Soul Mapper.